Yo, what's up guys? I'm gonna show you how to improve your court vision and your ball handling at the same time. It's a follow along workout that you need your phone for. You either set it like on a corner here like this and the bleachers over here like this. It's gonna take time to get the coordination and the body mechanics down. And then it's also gonna take time to get the reactions down. Watch this multiple times and, and follow along until you get to the point where maybe you've memorized everything and it's not so much of a reaction workout anymore. Follow along with me. Inside out and across, inside out and across. And I'm gonna have some numbers popping up on the screen and you gotta call them up, okay? So just keep this going, call out those numbers that are popping up and push your speed as you get the feel for the inside out into the cross or if you're advanced and you're already good with it, just keep rocking it out. Going as quick as you can with it, start getting it maybe lower, tighter, but calling those numbers out as they pop up. And this is gonna really help you with getting your handle to feel like second nature so that way you can keep your eyes up and focus what's happening on the court, see open teammates, all that stuff, okay? Next thing we're gonna do is I want you to take your body and turn it so now you can only see the phone out of your peripheral vision. So you wanna try to look forward and see the phone on the side. Now you probably won't be able to do it like this and still see the phone to your side. So you know I need to turn a little bit like here so your phone is like right here and you can kind of barely see it out of your peripheral vision. Keep turning as much as you need to, to look, you can still see the numbers popping up. You can see me on the screen right now and call them out. And then let's rock out again. Inside out into a cross. Calling out those numbers. Okay. And we're gonna up the ante each little chunk of this workout here. Keep it going. Inside out into a cross, inside out into a cross. Cool, now switch so you got the other side using your peripheral vision. To see the phone, same thing. Call out those numbers, push that speed, keep that drill alive. I bet it's distracting trying to listen to me and pull off the number counts and the dribbles all at the same time, right? I'm giving you some multi sensory input, and that's actually gonna really help you in game situations because in game situations, there's a lot of things happening that you gotta react to, right? This is gonna like sort of overload your senses so in games everything feels a lot easier to take in. Next we're gonna up that challenge in two ways. Number one, I want you to do a one hand B into a cross, one hand B into a cross, but I'm gonna just show you numbers with my hands so it's a little bit smaller on your screen. Pick up your basketball, turn to the side. Actually, we'll go the same way. So turn the same way that you did first time for the last move. Get kind of an angle if you need to. This one's gonna be a little bit tougher. So, you know, you might need to turn a little bit more, but try to use your peripheral vision if you can. This is gonna be a big challenge, okay? Here we go. basketball turn the other way same thing ready go Okay, pick up your basketball. Now, we're gonna jump back into things with a new combo. I'm gonna have the numbers popping up back on the screen. We're gonna go inside out into it between the legs, inside out into it between the legs. 
I'm gonna have the numbers popping up on the screen. I'm gonna dribble along with you here. Let's do it. You can't get this dribble down, that's okay. It'll take a little time to get the feel for it. Go ahead and rep it out, do the best you can. Maybe do it without the number counts at first until you get this dribble solid and this combo solid. And then from there, work your way up to doing it with the number counts. Pick up your basketball. Turn, peripheral vision. Ready? Let's do it. Call those numbers out. Try to use that peripheral vision. Woo. Don't be afraid if you lose the basketball from time to time. You can coach does. It's part of what we're doing here. We're trying to get better. Make your mistakes in practice, not in games. Get out of your comfort zone in practice so the game feels easy. Pick up your basketball, switch sides. Ready? Let's do it. Push that speed. Feel that basketball at your fingertips. Try to be quick with your eyes though, right? Think quick, call out the numbers quick. Couple more, couple more, push that speed. Try to pop that dribble, get a little pound into it. Hold your basketball. Okay, next combo, we're gonna switch things up. We're gonna go back to the one hand B, but then from there, we're gonna go behind this leg and then between from behind. So. One hand V, bringing the ball behind the leg, and then through from the back, or reverse between the legs. One hand V on the other side. Same thing here, bring it behind the leg, and back, just repeating the pattern. I'm gonna hold the numbers up again. Start dribbling. That's deep, keep it going, keep it going. Keep that drill alive. Pick up your dribble. Same combo, facing to the side. Let's go. Pick up your basketball, switch to the other side. Same combo. Let's go. I'm gonna push the speed on the number counts right now. Try to get as many as you can. Trick one right there, huh? Pick up your basketball. If you're having a hard time with these, you probably need to work a little bit on your ball control and your body coordination and your range of motion. I've got a free ball handling workout. It's a hybrid ball handling workout that'll help you improve your ball handling and your athleticism. I'll have it pinned to the top comment. If you want me to bring you more videos like this, so you know maybe if you start memorizing the number count and you want to work on new combos and things like that, let me know in the comments. In fact, I will put in the link down in the comments as well a playlist where if I do make some future videos, they'll all be in that playlist. 